I would not want to boost Lee Stranahan's platform. That that would be a terrible strategic mistake. It sounds like he didn't know who he was. He didn't know who I was. Actually, I know he didn't know who I was because he said that on his Periscope. He was trying to talk shit about me. He had no idea who I was. He had no idea that my business is doing research, that I've been one of the most successful researchers on Wall Street. Lee Stranahan is, is too ignorant or too lazy or too triggered to even do 15 minutes worth of internet searches about me to like see who I am, to understand that, gee, like I go on CNBC every other week. I go on TV. I go on Cheddar. I go on Fox Business. I go on Yahoo Finance. I go on CNBC multiple times a month with hundreds of thousands of live viewers each time. Why in the world would I want to give at least Stranahan's crappy little radio show platform the benefit of my presence? I would love, I would relish the chance to literally wipe the debate floor with you and totally expose you for the, the, the fraud that you are on a, on a fair platform. Now, Stranahan's actually been on Unirock. He's actually been interviewed on, on you. So that should be a friendly place. Unirock is known as being fair, but yeah, it seems like it. It seems like Lee got got. Because, you know, I just look at one tweet today that Lee Stranahan wrote. This seems to be a pattern. Gabe Hoffman and Associated Accounts are blocking people rather than trying to defend their position. No, Lee, your fans, most of them, if not all of them, are idiots. Lee Stranahan, I'm no fucking point, man. I'm just me. I'm smarter than you. I'm a better researcher than you. And you didn't know what the fuck you got hit with when you started shit with me. You started trying to connect me to Jeffrey Epstein somehow. That I live in Palm Beach County and that's Palm Beach. Crazy Isaac Cappy tried the same shit about, ooh, he asked if I'd ever rented in 666 Fifth Avenue. Like, first of all, who gives a fuck where my business rented somewhere in New York like eight years ago? Like, really? Because I didn't even rent from the building. I rented like offices from a law firm because it was like a huge building and I, I don't even need to explain